Welcome to Tinkernut.com's video cast. Please submit any requests or comments to Tinkernut.com. In this video, I'm going to continue with the networking theme and show you how to share folders between Windows Vista and Windows XP. Now, the first thing that you want to do is make sure that you have sharing enabled on both computers and you want to make sure you have something to share. So the easiest way to do this in Vista is drag whatever you want to the Vista public folder. Now the best way to access your XP machine is to type in its IP address in the Vista address bar. And I didn't have any problems with Vista accessing the XP machine. But now whenever I head over to the XP machine and try to access the Vista machine by typing in its IP address, I keep getting a login screen. But no matter what I put in, it keeps denying me access. So I'll show you how to remedy that. Head back over to the Vista machine and go to computer and right click on it and select manage and then you want to find where it says local users and groups and then click on the users folder now just right click in a blank area of that and select new user now just type in a username that you want to use to log in and type in a password and then make sure that you have user must change the password unchecked and check the one that says password never expires then just click create and close. Now when you go back over to the XP machine use that username and password to log in and it should bring up the Windows Vista files that you're sharing. So I just created a folder called XP files and as you can see I can now access them. Alright well that's it for this tutorial. For more go to tinkernut.com